Here we have a 68 plate BMW 540i X-Drive M Sport. Now with this vehicle you've got the gloss black 20 inch alloy wheels, all in excellent condition as you can see just there and complemented by the blue M Sport calipers just behind. We've got the black sapphire metallic exterior paintwork and as you can see the vehicle is all stealthed out. Looks absolutely fantastic. Got the black kidney grills at the front as well as the black splitter down below. Going around to this corner you'll see your second 20 inch alloy wheel, colour coded wing mirrors and door handles, black trim around the windows with the privacy glass for the rear passengers, we've got the black side skirts down at the bottom as well, we've also got a sliding glass sunroof on this vehicle too is currently open as you can see just there. Now coming to the rear there's a closer look at your third 20 inch alloy wheel, we've then got the spoiler lip at the rear. We've also got a reversing camera and front and rear parking sensors as well as the dual exit exhaust, one on either side as well as that rear diffuser which looks fantastic. Opening up the boot just to see what kind of space we've got in here. There we go, plenty of storage space inside for whatever you may need. Storage net on the left hand side there to keep your items secure. Closing that up, you'll notice that the vehicle is free from any major marks, dents or scratches and there is a closer look at your last alloy wheel. Now heading on to the interior next we've got the full leather interior with the contrasting stitching and how fantastic do these seats look. ISO fix points within the seats, fold down armrest in the centre, temperature controls in the middle with the additional storage and 12 volt connectivity, storage pockets behind the front seats, on the doors you've got this fantastic looking trim with the ambient lighting built in, brush metal handle, integrated Harman Kardon sound system and your electric window controls. Coming on to the front now, We've got that same full leather interior, incredibly comfortable seats, and again, how fantastic do these look? Now, both of the front seats do have electrical adjustments on their sides as well. You've then got that same Harman Kardon sound system in the front. Unlock and lock button, more of a fantastic looking trim and the ambient lighting. Electric power folding wing mirrors with electric window controls. You've also got a boot release down there as well. Now stepping inside the vehicle, auto lights can be found on your right. We'll now start the vehicle up foot and the brake start start button and we are away. Now as you can see straight away we have got the digital display and how fantastic does that look. Now that will actually change depending on what driving mode we're in. So there you can see we've got sport. Comfort and Eco Pro. It's just a nice little touch that that will change for you depending on which driving mode you're in. You've then got your multifunctional steering wheel with different controls for whilst you're on the go, such as speed limiter and cruise control, phone controls, volume controls, paddle shifters just behind for taking manual control of your gears, auto wipers on the right hand side there. We've also got the heads up display so your eyes don't need to leave the road to see what speed you're doing at the time. Engine start start button just behind on the left. Coming into the centre we've got the touchscreen infotainment system and how fantastic does that look. Plenty of great tech on here as well. Like the satellite navigation you can see just there. We've also got various ways to connect for the media slash radio. Radio wise we've got DAB, FM and AM. We've also got our music collection, CD slash DVD, Bluetooth audio and USB. So plenty of ways to connect your devices. You've also got phone connectivity for making calls. Going on to the menu now. Can have a flick through here. One thing to show off as well is of course the ambient lighting. So if we go on here to the interior lighting, we've got a huge array of colours we can choose from here. And just look at that vast selection, which at night time looks absolutely fantastic. Now going on back, scroll through again quickly. You can see just there, put the vehicle into reverse. You've got your front and rear visual display of your parking sensors as well as your reversing camera on the right hand side. We've also got the intelligent safety in this vehicle, 
which you can configure just there. And like I mentioned before, of course, the different driving modes like Sport, Sport Plus, Comfort and Eco Pro. So you can pick and choose which mode best suits your driving style at the time. Coming on down, you've then got your stereo controls with traffic alerts on the left, as well as your dual zone climate control, so you can control each side independently. Heated seat controls for both front passengers. You've then got more of this fantastic looking trim throughout the center console additional storage space a usb connection point two good size cup holders and more 12 volt connectivity shortcuts touchpad and control wheel again for the infotainment screen on our left hand side here with the gear stick here we can take manual control as well should we wish like so you can also engage sport mode in the same way traction control different mode selects you've also got a button for your parking sensors to turn them on or off electronic handbrake with the auto hold feature and of course the soft touch lever armrest which does double up as storage as well you've got a usb a 12 volt connection point there as well now of course last but not least we've got the sliding glass sunroof which to close we'll simply push like so and as you can see and here that all works exactly as you would expect same for the blind as well now the vehicle is ready to drive away today with free next day nationwide delivery competitive low finance fresh service fresh mot and it's also hbi clear that is all from me on today's video thank you for watching video test job of this bmw 540i now the purpose of this video test drive today is to show that the vehicle drives exactly how you'd expect it to now, as you can see, I'm not to fight my steering wheel to keep it straight line, so it's straight and true, not veering off to the left or to the right hand side. Now, I do have a multi function steering wheel with cruise control and speed limiter on the left hand side. Now, to activate it, so we push the button at the top, then it goes to the nearest miles an hour. Push up base slightly, it'll just buy a one. Push up your tail field, a bit of a click, and it'll just to the nearest five miles an hour. Now, to cancel, simply just press the brake or double click on the button that you just pressed, and it'll then cancel. Now do our panel shift if we stay the car into manual mode, which we're going to take over now. So coming over first, up to second, into third, into fourth, into fifth, back down to fourth, into fifth again, and then I'm going to let the car take back over by simply just letting go. Now I can also push the gear stick to the left hand side, it goes into M or S, M meaning manual and S being sport. Now put it into S, it revs the rev range a lot longer and sharpens up those gear changes. Now we do have the digital dash. So when you do change for your different drive modes, it also changes with you. You also have your heads-up display, giving you the speed that you're currently travelling at. Nice addition to have, so if you're able to keep looking up and down, and straight there in front of your vision. Now I do have the integrated harm can speakers, which do sound absolutely incredible. Big satellite navigation screen in the centre, where you can also find your Bluetooth media, Bluetooth audio connectivity, DAB radio, your rear reversing camera with your front and rear parking sensors visual display. Now I do have very comfortable full leather seats throughout this vehicle. Both front seats are also heated for those cold winter mornings, but it does make all the difference. You have your power folding mirrors there as well. So right now we're going up to industrial state, where I'm going to take a right. I'm going to perform a mode to stop probably straight into reverse just to show that the brakes work exactly how you'd expect them to and you'll see pop up on the centre screen the rear reverse camera. So emergency stop in 3, 2, 1. Hard on the brakes straight into reverse, no issues whatsoever and you can see the rear camera just then and your front and rear parking sensors back into drive again, no issues whatsoever. Now if you're test driving this vehicle today you'll be listening out for anyone's knocks or bangs and if you've been listening out during this test drive video there hasn't been any which is always a bonus when buying a used car. Now, if you haven't answered all the questions and inquiries during this test drive and walk around video, please feel free to get in contact with the sales team where they can answer any answer questions and also run through some inquiries with you. But that's it from in this water video, video test drive video. See you soon. Cheers.